Schneider claimed that their new wireless lighting wall controller offers quick and simple installation. The wireless functionality ensures minimal disruption, which is ideal for listed buildings or glass walls. It can be easily retrofitted and is controlled locally or remotely. Sound great? Let's see what our product tester thinks. Hi, my name's Evan of Lexicon Limited. I'm here to put the Schneider Electric Sphere system for its paces. Today I'm installing the Sphere system at St Mary's Church Higher Broughton. It can also be used in domestic, commercial and industrial premises. I'm about to install this dimming receiver unit into the existing mural lighting circuit. I'll take you through the paces as I go. The circuit's already been isolated and I've got a little piece of cable to prep it. I, I've just prepared the unit by unscrewing the lid with one screw there and I've taken off the cord grip. I'm now going to open the terminal so that they are ready to receive the cables. At this point I'm now going to take out the load side connectors. That connects to the load terminals. I'm now connecting the load side of the sphere receiver doing that so that I've got line to line and neutral to neutral. And that's the connection for load. And I'm now connecting the extension to the supply side. I'm now just tidying up the leads and I'm going to terminate the CPC with the provided terminal block. Now fitting the cord grip retainer. Now it's just a simple case of putting on the cover. I'm going to fit this back into the supply, tighten the screws, make sure we are still connected and then simply push it back into place, put the retaining screws in and just put back the original cabling as far as we can and then we just pop the mini trunking. Now we have a completed fitted receiver unit to extend the aerial and if possible access to the lead which tells you what's going on and the reset button there. This can be tidied up of course. I'm about to install the second wall lighting circuit receiver. What I've already done is I've put one in situ here and all it does is it sits in line with the existing switching so the existing switch in this, it doesn't need to be moved. And there's the new wiring for it there. I've fitted the receiver. Now all I have to do is assign the controller to the receiver. Okay, we turn the supply on. And just above the lead here, there is a reset button. If you use something suitable to press and hold it until it starts flashing. As you can see, the light source that it's controlling was flashing in recognition. I'm now going to assign it to two. It's flashing again, saying that it's understood that. And the light level has come up. If I now press that, it should turn off, which it has done, it's dimmed. If I want to turn the lamp on, press two. And what do I want to do? Dim up, dim down, or off. I'm now going to have a bash at programming a scene. To do that, you press a selected button, I'm going to select 8, and the up and down arrows at the same time, until the unit flashes. You'll see that the lights have come up and flashed. That's telling me that it's now in I want to remember mode. I've got to tell it what it needs to do, so 1, which was a scene above the altar, I'm now going to take down to 0, the chandelier, 
which I'm now pressing. There it goes. But because it's on a relay, it stays on. So what I've got to do now is press it until it switches off. The scene that I do want to set is that the wall lights, which will be flashing now, I want them dimmer than they are at the minute, say about there, about 50%. And that's the scene I want, just the wall lights are 50%. Once I press the button, it will remember that. So hopefully now, when I press 8, just the wall lights will come on at 50%. In addition to the handheld controller, you can install a fixed controller. That can either fit in a purpose-made back box, like so, which can either be screwed to the wall or with the provided sticky back stickers stuck to the wall, which is what I'm going to do. I've fitted the receiver modules here today and the relay module and I'm very happy with the product. Uh, the fact that you can fit it at the consumer unit, you don't have to fit it at the device. It's excellent. So there you have it, an easy and fast system to install. The control is wireless so there is no disruption from channeling walls to install extra cabling. That's great for listed buildings such as this church, but even for modern offices that might have glass, concrete or even steel walls. So, if you want a cost-effective control solution that is simple to install and program, then check out Schneider Electric's Sphere System.